Hello and welcome back to Toronto FC Fan TV and it's Toronto 1, Cruz Azul 3, what can I say, terrible performance, abysmal defending. That is some of the worst defending I've seen in my life. These men couldn't defend themselves in a court case. Those set pieces, they're getting beat on every single one. I know I said to shake up the defense and he did, he put in Zavaleta, but don't take out Singh, take out Gonzalez. Gonzalez is the worst defender at this club. When are the BB going to realize? He is slow. He was even getting beaten in the air today. His one and only skill. We gotta do better than this. Turin Cruz Azul scored early with Tenaria. He scored really early. But then we, respond we responded to that goal really well. Moro drove really hard and forward and got it to Azorio who was able to put it in. But things went from bad to worse after that. Tenorio scored a brace. And they scored again to finish the game off. Two set-piece goals we got conceded on. And honestly, they could have had six or seven. There was two penalties that were not called against us that probably should have been. And our defending, it is something else, man. It is it is incredibly bad. And Chris Armes, his subs were not much better. He decided to go all attacking, but you don't... You take off Altidore, who, to be honest, wasn't good today at all. But you take off Altidore to put on Patrick freaking Mullins? No, Mullins! He is the epitome of average. You leave Akinol on the bench. Sure, you bring him on later, but you put him on the wing in the 80th minute? First of all, he's not a winger. And second of all, you bring him way too late to make a difference. So either you gotta, you gotta, Chris Armas, you gotta shake up the squad, or you gotta shake up the tactics. Because either you change the tactics that it's not all guns ablazing and just gonna expose the back, because... We are holding two or three goals almost every game now. Or you gotta shake up the squad. I put in Westberg. Bono had slow reactions today. He had a couple of suspicious moments that looked like, oh, you're gonna give a goal away. So put in Westberg. When Mavinga's healthy, put him and Mavinga as the partnership. Drop Aro. Aro has not been good so far this season. Put in Lorea at right back and Moro at left. Prizo, I love Prizo, but I don't think it's working between him and Bradley. Maybe give him a few more chances with a better defense, but I'd put Delgado and Bradley as the partnership. With Pozuelo not being healthy yet, put Leva Zorio in the 10, he's our most creative player. On the wings, might as well start, start Sotel though, our new de designated player, might as well start him on the wing. Put Akinola up top, because if you start him, he will score goals, we proved that last season, so make sure you start Akinola on the right wing, I don't know, Delian I guess, but... We gotta do something, because Champions League is our next game again against Cruz Azul, and if we put that same squad with those same tactics, we're holding 5 or 4, I'm telling you. Anyways, this has been Toronto FC Fan TV, and see ya.